I'm back from working out. <laughs> oh, I feel so tired. Hey everybody, welcome to another episode. I'm so energetic, I'm crazy. Anyways, I finally built that discipline and I hope I didn't lose it again. Every day I have to be energetic because there's a goal in my mind to get 5,000 diamond ores and hopefully I can beat the record. And when I do that, I will also do fundamental things in this world. Some lovely ideas, some great things to add here because... I'm still, this build is still under the structure. I'm still trying to improve how this Andrew Steel base look like. After a couple days, I might figure out a better design because I'm still trying to improve this. Because you see this blue color with these yellow colors, it just, how does it fit together? It's weird, you know? I'm hoping to find ideas to help me out. But for today's episode, I got two tasks. The first task is to clear all the larches that I have in this world and go to and go back to my base and go back to my starter base get my shulker boxes that i have on this chest and gather all the resources all of it and put it to this amazing storage system because at this day i'm gonna be sitting down here commentating about the projects and i will no longer go to that little base to gather stuff i, I don't need to go there anymore i need to use the storage system come on man i got one little thing i like to keep my precious items in a specific storage that doesn't have redstone but you know, I'll just put the good stuff in there. Some diamond tools, maybe some stuff that is important to me. Because if I just throw it in my storage system and then go to this uh, random silo, it'll be a little bit weird. It feels like I'm throwing my eyes at this random storage and I just threw the value out of my good stuff. I'm stressing myself to go mining again in this episode. I've done six hours of mining and I got this. And I want to get another box of diamonds like this, but... I hope I can get six stacks like I said in the best episode. So at this moment, I need to open my shulker box and fix these four pickaxes one more time. <laughs> and then break them again. Why do I constantly break these specific pickaxes? And I hope I don't bother you with my different microphone because uh, in the middle of the progress, I want to work on some things, but they are a little bit complicated when I record them. Like when I make montages for them and I want to make my editing better. Sometimes making my editing better waste so much energy in me i would rather work on this game more than editing the videos but i will edit the commentaries of course i will make the video more entertaining and lower the amount of montages that i make in one day because i just want to go through the process immediately and show you what i got like that like the last like the latest episode when i was messing around with the redstone i was so happy with my editing style so i might stick with it for five episodes if i like it i will keep going if i don't like it i might just you know come back to the montages and stuff it's just these little buildings that i want to start commentating about without making lots of montages for no reason it feels better that way but now let's get started for the mining progress and fix these little pickaxes now is the diamond progress activate <laughs> This is interesting, I got tired as soon as I started mining, so I had to sleep and then I went back to mining again. So we got another 5 shulker boxes. This box will have the diamonds from these boxes. So let's check our profit for this episode mining. First shulker box, stack of diamond ores and 6. Second shulker box, a stack and 19. Stack and 11. And stack and 42! What? <laughs> Yo, this is my first time actually. Let's go. I was close to six stacks, you know. It's completely fine, man. One day we will get that six stacks. I was really mining for six hours and a half and I really got exhausted. I usually don't get exhausted when I mine, but yeah, this is a new day. <laughs> but this is exciting. Let me get these uh, specific chocolate boxes that has diamonds on them. Why? <laughs> Every time I commentate, you have to turn off. My controller has a weird system where... It will charge, but not actually like load the charge. Oh, I meant like when I plug the controller on the wire, it will stay on, but it will not charge. So as soon as I take out that plug, the controller just turns off and it just pisses me off. It's a PS5 controller, man. Why do I have to deal with these problems? And also the drifting problems. Why do I deal with these drifty stuff? Like I might just move forward constantly or just like look left. I and mean, I hope these things don't make me quit the game because it, I'm so tired of it. Oh yeah, these chocolate boxes, I wanted to put them in the storage system because when I left the storage system flying away to get something, I forgot I was actually gonna turn off the chunks. I forgot that I would actually make the chunks stop working. So one of these hovers actually got disconnected and the western pressure got higher. It actually broke this area. 
But I solved it, I searched everywhere and this storage system seems to be working fine again. And I would never fly away when the storage system is working. We need some of this blue. Yeah! Isn't it fun? Just like searching for the color that I need. Or like look for something. I need cactus maybe. Oh, maybe some greens. Oh, I don't have anything. Uh, oh shit. <laughs> I haven't done the progress yet. This is so fun! Look at this! <laughs> I'm gonna give names to these chocolate boxes. So let's check my first mining chocolate box on the latest episode. I think it's this one, four stacks. This is the first chocolate box for mining, and this is the second one, so I'm gonna name these. Hoping to find an anvil on this random large chest. Okay, good, we found it. Boom. Diamond box one, diamond box two. I'm imagining to make a whole line of diamond chocolate boxes. So this is the first episode of mining, and this is the second episode of mining. I need to go to three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine episodes of just diamond mining. So I need to constantly keep mining until I get this line complete. And those boxes, I would throw them somewhere else or just put them in this large chest. Now to the serious task. We're gonna gather some random stuff from my world and clean the trash that I have and go to my starter base and just take everything from there and put it to my actual storage system so I can finally say this is my final episode from this starter base because I'm gonna live here forever yes <laughs> I'm excited for this day so let's just start messing around all of the chocolate boxes uh nah I go for four chocolate boxes every time that's the safer option oh yeah it's night time lovely let me just take a nap oh jeez. uh I will just place the chocolate boxes outside. Oh, uh, <laughs> it feels weird now taking all these down. Wait, I cannot put chocolate boxes with chocolate boxes. Uh, it feels complicated, but it's gonna be a lot worth it when I finish. Mother of God, what are these chocolate boxes? <laughs> I was not expecting that. This is a crazy amount of iron I'm gonna use. <laughs> but the only problem with this progress is when I finish all of this, I feel a bit upset that I have to AFK for so long for my storage systems to store all the items in the storage. That's the only problem that I actually am gonna deal with. AFKing for so long and not make the video very fast. I need to like take all these resources but at the same time I have to wait for so long. It's a matter of AFK and then everything will work out. All my plans gonna be perfect at the end of the day, don't worry about it. I got so many resources I cannot imagine that anymore. I'm actually leaving the starter base man, I'm so excited for this day. Alright, let's keep it up. Look at these diamonds. <laughs> Is that everything here? Okay, we're gonna finish the other side. Also, these chocolate boxes, I'm just gonna take them immediately. The only problem is this stuff. That's fine. I will just throw it in the storage system. I don't care. I'm gonna see it in the random silo. We get this chocolate box and take down this barrel too. Oh, uh, my skull. <laughs> it's my rarest item. Oh, it's so weird throwing my elites right here. Oh, no. Look at this. <laughs> I'm still working. All right, let's go. This is a reason why you need a storage system in your life. <laughs> <laughs> Why am I suffering with this stupid stuff? Such a good advice. Just build a storage system in your survival world or whatever. Because hell no, I'm not dealing with these chocolate boxes if I was actually going to deal with them. Oh my god, look at this. It's so beautiful but bad. It's so empty. It reminds me of the back room. Now, I don't know how I'm going to do this. Am I going to like store all of these in my inventory somehow? I'll just try to take the amount that I can handle and then put it somewhere. Let's see how much we can handle. Oh my god, I have a sword in my inventory. Where do I put this? All right there. All right, we're full of shocker boxes, full of stuff. Look at it. Probably just place it on the side like this, like this, this line of shocker boxes. I got nowhere to place them. I just don't know what to do actually. This task is so scary to do. I need to do so much cleaning. But imagine if I like place all these shocker boxes in this uh, dropper system, but then the, all the items actually disappear by accident because I made one accident and then all the items got stuck somewhere and all of them disappear because the dropper keeps constantly dropping them. It's... I'm gonna cry if, if that happens. <laughs> I hope that doesn't happen. What? When did I break this block? I guess it's polished block. Let me search for the polished. Yeah. Such a lovely storage system. It helps me a lot. Okay, this is the first two lines. We need to gather more boxes now. Let's see if we can handle these boxes. Did we miss any boxes? Uh, I don't think so. Let's see. Oh yeah, we can handle that. I mean, after filling these boxes in there, I need to also like do these ones too because I have so many redstone blocks. I don't think it will fit the storage system at all. So I'm thinking I'm gonna keep the redstone later and then I will fill it myself so I can keep it safe. I don't wanna lose redstone. We're gonna fill the third line now. Oh, it's time for bed. Oh, I'm gonna... Okay. 
Okay, we're good. I guess it's time to clear all of this now. Oh my god, so many beautiful ores I want to actually take with me. Let's just say I'm gonna take this box of lapis and this box of iron, this box of gold, and take these ones too, yeah. And then this one, I will ignore it. And there's so much andesite here. Oh, there's more ores. And uh, yeah, these ones, I will take them with me. Oh yeah, I can clear this one. This one is easy. All right, let's add more extra work. I don't know if I'm surprised or I'm just amazed. Let's check out on the free shackle boxes that doesn't have items on them. Those ones are important. I don't want to put them in the storage system. There's lots of free shock boxes I want to take with me and put it on the different chest. Just because I want to recognize them, they will be useful later. Everything feels clean. Oh my god. It's been so long for me to just live this clean life. <laughs> I don't know. But I think it's time to put all the shock boxes in the storage. So let's begin on the painful task to wait for maybe like 14 hours for everything to get stored. I hate that, but I guess I just gotta handle the pain. It's not pain, I just AFK and everything works, I guess. I, I just got one issue with this storage thing. This chest cannot store that much shocker boxes, and that's what makes me feel worried. I wanna make it bigger, but I don't know how. Let me just get some chest and try to improve it. Oh no, oh. Oh, oh no, everything will feel combined now. Uh, like this, yeah, I just wanted to do that. Oh jeez, there's so many boxes to deal with. Now I'm gonna improve this by placing the largest underneath. And add the hopper just on the side. Let me just do it quickly before I confuse myself. Yep, there we go. And I have to, oh. I, th I was gonna say I'm gonna fly all the way there, but then I realized I have a hole here. Oh, it, it, it looks even better. All right, let's improve the top one. Just one large chest like that, and maybe add another hopper. Come on, man. All right, now we're doing good. Now for the scary part, we're gonna put the shulker boxes. Such a nightmare. Everything is getting stored today. This feels like one of my biggest shulker sorting hopper item solving prob- I don't know. <laughs> let's just, just look at this. It's crazy! Even the dispenser. Everything's crazy. Alright, I'm gonna actually AFK and play Roblox or maybe do something or chat with people. I don't know. See you soon. So, I AFK'd for hours and hours. And guess what happened? Uh... <laughs> oh, I hate this so much. Well, I can't click the hover. It's empty now. And it, uh, this one has like one leaf. What happened to this one? But probably it's because the redstone got so much pressure that everything got filled. So the side effects of this storage system, if one of these large chests get filled, it will add so much pressure to the, ho to the other hoppers and break everything. And everything will become empty that the rest of the items will get stuck in here. So I need to do so much clean up now. I feel stupid that I put myself into this. You know what I could have done? I could have just clicked on this hopper and take this sand with me and add the stone and leave the sand in here just just never touch it anymore just so i can let the stone and the rest of the items go to the silo because look at this look at this nothing touched the silo because as soon one of these lushes get filled the system get broken so none of the sand and stone will get into this silo and i have kids for so long i feel so disappointed uh. <laughs> i'll do a cleanup for the store system also on this side because that side also got broken we'll go to these droppers and take the stone from them sand checkmate stone chest checkmate cobblestone chest Checkmate. A lot of checkmates. And I've cleaned everything. I am ready to put these shocker boxes inside one more time. And ugh, AFK again, I guess. <laughs> what do I do when I'm AFKing? I, I want to figure out something else. I hate to do this because my whole episode is going to be just full of AFKing dealing with this problem. I've said that like so many times and I just want to say it again. I don't want to make this episode take so long to upload or a stupid issue like that. And we're back with a good microphone. <laughs> but hey, listen to me. When I finish this progress and actually solve the problem, because I think I already solved it now, I don't have to deal with it no more. I'm focused on the little stuff from the storage system to put in here. And then the big stuff will be in the silo, like I said. After all of this fixing and solving, I might do another mining. I might go for crazy progress, but I would do another four big axes of mining while finishing this problem. I feel mentally ill for a little bit. I feel like no matter what I hard work, I might just fall down. I sometimes need a break and just recognize who I am. Not to push too hard because I love being disciplined, I swear. Sometimes there's side effects that scares me, but at the same time, I love that feeling. I might fail this again, but I have no choice but to fail again and go mining and ignore it. I don't need to do checking because I've been doing 25 check. <laughs> I do, I've done 25 checkmates. Now let's do this actually. Why am I imagining that I put that named stone block 
in one of these chocolate boxes that might ruin the storage system. I would I would not overthink it. Or I would just I would just I would just work. I hate my mind. It always answers my questions in a scary way. Do I have more shocker boxes? If I search around, oh yeah, I do. I do. I hope for the best. I actually changed this chest to a regular deep slate, and I'm excited to see it getting filled. I'm excited to see the sand and the other stones to go in this silo. So let me just check what kind of stuff we're getting at the first place. He's dropping sand. That means I should check the silo right now. And see if it's actually getting sand. If it actually works, I'm so excited. If it doesn't work, that means I have to go back and fix this before everything goes downhill. So let's just open this chest and see what's going on. Or let's just fly, actually. Let's just fly behind the redstone. I do not trust, trust this redstone at all. Ooh, that's interesting. I hope I didn't crash anything with my flying skills. I believe in this system. Come on, work. <gasps> no! I see the sand going in. I knew it! I knew it, it's falling, it's falling, it's stupid, I knew this is gonna happen. I cannot let this happen, I'm not, I cannot let this continue. I knew it was something gonna go downhill. Why do I trust this machine? Why do I always trust this machine? It's crazy how it's going in the middle right here. Why is it behaving this way? Why can't you just, just go forward, I guess? Oh, is that gravel? Alright. I'm hoping to see the gravel. Continue gravel, you got this. This is my last test. If it works, I'm happy. Oh my god, it's actually doing something. <gasps> yeah! <laughs> Oh, oh, okay. So that's the quartz chest that got broken. Oh, interesting. I want to know why that happened. I just want to know why. How? Oops. I still forgot about these chocolate boxes. I was just excited for this part. We're getting more gravel. <laughs> Let's go. All right, I'm taking the boxes with me. And I will try to AFK and notice the problems that might happen. Every one hour, hopefully. And the third time, the storage system failed one more time. <laughs> well, boys, I'm not that upset. I actually found a solution for this. I'm really, really excited to fix the storage system. Well, my design was from Mumbo Jumbo, and I trusted his design so, so much that I actually built the whole thing by it. And I feel stupid for doing that. Because the problem is, behind that storage system that I built, it doesn't have a safe sorter item collector. If it gets higher than a stack, everything gets broken. All the machines drop, and then... You will see the items just flowing everywhere. It, it will get overflowed, I think. So to solve the issue, I will go to my creative vault and show you my plan. I kind of changed my plan. I was going to go for diamond mining, but today we're solving the problem. Because I seen it, I tested it, and it's crazy. It, it handles 41 items until it gets to stack and it doesn't get overflowed. When I literally, if I, if I build that design, it will help my silo too. So here it is, Silence Whispers designed for item sorting. So how it works, it just collects about 41 items and then you put anything you want. Rather just put that here. Let's just say cobblestone and then I can just put the whole stack in there and then wait until it gets to 41. If it gets to 41, it's perfect. So let's wait for it. 3, 2, 1, 41. That's what I want. I don't want to deal with 18. I used to like uh, have the maximum of 18, but when it gets higher than 18, everything gets broken. But this one, this one is perfect because we have a piston right here connected to our redstone torch faster than a repeater. But it might take me longer to build. I, I said that so loud, sorry. But the happy thing is, I will never change anything. The slabs remains at the same place. And after placing all the pistons, because uh, something will go wrong, the pistons will push each other. Uh, I'm just gonna place obsidian block at the last block and then keep everything safe. And even right with my silo, you will see the obsidian last block, it will look perfect. It's crazy how I did all of this and I'm still not upset. Instead, I got more excited. This is the issue, I just love playing Minecraft, okay? I can't stop. No matter how many times I will face issues, I'll still want to solve it. Just to keep everything safe, I will take down all the water sources. So I can take down the slabs that has repeaters on it. After making it safe, we will take down the whole redstone machine without taking down the hoppers, only, only the stuff that has redstone on it. So let's attempt that complicated challenge because I also have to take down the nine D stone blocks and the rest of the items and somehow keep them in a safe storage so I can replace them. That's so much work. <laughs> But welcome to my reality, I have to solve the problem. Pistons, a little bit of redstone, and tons of glass. I removed the water, so I'm ready. Wait, no, no, no way. It's actually so simple. I was gonna take down the whole thing. I can actually just break this block and place the piston in, 
and then change this block to glass and remove this repeater and place rest on the oh my god let me just try that oh what the oh yeah slabs okay i'm gonna be surprised if that's actually so easy to build i think i placed all of it hopefully i ran out of it so let's hope for the best uh, can i have some obsidian yeah look at all the competitors they look sad An obsidian right here all right everything's perfect why am I, st I keep falling objective number one got complete it's time for objective number two break these blocks and make them to glass oh shit all right solved it the last part seems interesting i'm just on the ground i can oh i see the person right there that's the dropper system for the whole machine well sometimes we gotta deal with something interesting so i finished this one side look at this the glass blocks at the redstone are so beautiful now we gotta continue on the other side to the last side so it's gonna be difficult but uh, i have to make a surface to start like fixing the part this is the last part right now all right the server's done let's fly all the way back to the mansion Whee! and i think we're safe to just start digging all right here's the surface underneath me the last redstone line i mean the second redstone line and just add the glass to the last redstone dust Ooh. all right did i place all the obsidian blocks yeah i'm just missing this one piston one last check let me just look around one two three one two and then three ow ow oh my god i'm gonna die and then these yeah i saw these now to the boring part fixing the hovers and putting the correct items i'm not gonna use big cax i'm gonna use my fist because i'm strong i'm gonna break it with my strong fist oh china boring i hate this uh knife in sight put it here look at the hopper go to the next hopper click that button here look at the hopper go to the next hopper <laughs> it's painful i got so much space here that I might actually build something amazing. But I still don't have the idea yet. I have to finish lots of buildings in this. Just stay protective on this build. It's just fun to experience some amazing structures to play with. I'm discovering some designs, baby. I've learned my lesson to build storage systems and now I feel so much better that I learned that. Why am I in low health? <sighs> Let me just showcase the whole storage. It's not that different. It's just that white glass fits the smooth stone so well that it feels like it's a new project now. And I'm proud of myself. I actually passed the day I slipped and I kind of waste my time on social media. I should not do that. But it's lovely to message people in Discord. But after all that work, it's time to take the shock boxes and put it to the storage and say my goodbyes because i think this is all i got for this episode i have nothing left it's kind of upsetting that the whole progress was all about these chocolate boxes and moving from house to house but life is all about facing challenges and solving problems i really have to record these moments where minecraft really fell on me and when i face it and when i face issues i don't want to be alone with it i want to let people know these things exist and it will happen to anybody if they fail and make that mistake but that's the fun part minecraft experience but i believe in this system now i tried it uh haven't really put all the items i haven't like put stacks of stacks of items to every each of these chests of hoppers but if my gold farm works fine and my hopper system thing this one would work too but i might do another mining in that next episode but anyways this is all i have for this episode i hope you all enjoyed it and i will see you to the next one goodbye good job nano you said the outro and you forgot to add the water